Hey guys, I'm in my kitchen again. <laughs> oh, y'all didn't see that. That's for tomorrow. Come back tomorrow for a fun recipe collab with some beautiful people. But today, I have a grocery haul and a meal plan for you. So let's hop to it. This time I'm going to show you my meal plan first. Okay, we're going to start with today. today. Well, let's recap for the week because I don't think I showed you guys my meal plan last week. So... Um, Thursday, I made a grilled pork tenderloin, mashed potatoes, salad, and garlic bread. Friday was pie pies. Saturday, I made just cheeseburgers on the grill and some tater tots. Last Sunday was the beefy, well, I put beefy vegetable soup, but I turned it into stew um, and cornbread. I shared that recipe with you guys this past week. I will make sure to link it down below and up in the cards. Monday, I made the ham and cheese sliders that you guys saw the other day, so I will make sure I link that recipe too. When, uh, Tuesday, I did um, sheet pan fajitas. That was pretty delicious. Uh, yesterday, for me, um, was Wednesday, and I made ground beef stroganoff with uh, steamed mixed vegetables and garlic bread. Using my leftover sliders that I did not use, I just turned them into garlic toast. Tonight, I'm working on a recipe for Croctober. Make sure you come back Saturday to see what it was. Friday, let me tell you about Friday. For me, that is tomorrow. For you, that was today. <laughs> we have Hurricane Delta out in the Gulf. It is going to go, sadly, into Lake Charles, is what they're predicting. But And that kind of leaves us on the clean side. But we're supposed to get a lot of wind and rain because the eye is direct in the center, so it's a pretty big storm. So I thought, hmm, it's gonna be a rainy day. I'm gonna make some chili in the crock pot. And of course, when I do that, I make hot dogs for those who don't want chili. Saturday, I'm gonna make patty melts and tater tots. We have not had patty melts in a long time. Yum, yum, yum. Sunday, I'm gonna make chicken and dumplings because Sunday and soup and to me chicken and dumplings is like a soup that will make my my guys happy they all love it so we're gonna have that Monday 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 uh, this will be a furloughed week for my husband um, if you missed that announcement I don't know if I said anything or not but now you know so um on Monday I'm on the way home from work I'm picking up pie pies because um yum who doesn't like pie pies on a Monday come on I'm not cooking on a Monday uh next Tuesday we're gonna have river ranch roast it's my favorite mashed potatoes and green beans and probably probably biscuits yum um Wednesday I am going to make something else in the crock pot for the next Saturday, October. Thursday, I'm gonna make sloppy joes and french fries. Friday, I'm gonna make Italian chicken cutlets with pasta and sauce and garlic toast. Saturday, I have left open. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. It may be a takeout day or it might be a, uh, I don't know, I haven't figured it out. I'm leaving it open. I know we have a brisket in the, in the oven in the oven in the freezer and we're supposed to get a cold front that day so maybe I don't know and then the following Sunday is another Croctober recipe very simple so yeah it's gonna be a tasty week so let's hop into the groceries so I utilized HEB again because they are doing free delivery through the middle of the month they extended it works perfect for me um, they deliver it to your door and yes I love it so <clears throat> I will tell you the only there's two odd things but it works out it's not a big deal I thought I ordered the five pound um, club pack of ground beef but apparently this is a three pound which is fine because I discovered I had some more ground beef in the um, freezer so I'm gonna bag this up into one one pound bag for chili because I only use a pound of ground beef in mine and then I'm going to bag the other two up together as well um, and that will be for I don't know I might do them individually that way if I don't want to do I have it 
to work in different ways. <laughs> I'm like, let's get to the point, Sheila. And then I have a big pack of chicken breast. I think there's three, four, five, six in here. Um, it was $10, not too bad. And I'm going to divide this in half. I already showed you guys in the last grocery haul how I break up my meat and freeze it and prep it. I bought another roast because it was on sale. This one was $8.48. And it was a three pound roast. So that is pretty delicious. I'm half tempted to pull out part of it and cut it into stew meat, but I think I'm just going to make a roast because that's yum. I needed some more margarine. We use that on toast. Sometimes we use butter. I like to have the option of both, um, and I always use butter because I have some baking to do. I got this big thing of hot dog wieners. Um, I think there's 20 in there. Uh, I'll make those to go with the chili tomorrow, and then the the twins eat them the next day. All 20 of those will be gone, which is crazy. Um, some lunch meat. I just picked up a small pack of oven roasted turkey breast and the mesquite smoked. We haven't really been eating sandwiches, but I wanted to have some because I have none. Uh, some shredded cheese. That is for chili and for part of the recipe tonight. Two gallons of tea, there was already one in there. Two gallons of milk, I already have one in there. Quilted Northern, it was time to go ahead and stock back up. <clears throat> uh, paper plates, my family loves plates. Problem is right now I'm having a hard time getting and selecting what I usually get on HEB's thing because they have a hard time keeping them in stock. Um, we have a lot of people that have been traveling back and forth to Louisiana to help those who have been really suffering from Hurricane, um, what was, Laura, and then they also got part of, um, Beta, <laughs> and now we have Delta going that way, so I'm not going to complain, and I don't mind using regular plates, but my family likes paper plates, so there you go. I Chinette's okay. I prefer Dixie, but whatever. Blah, blah, blah. I have two diet orange sodas because um, I just wanted them. <laughs> uh, Shelby's dog food and some cat food. Um, this is H-E-B brand, I guess, version of Gain. I've been using Tide for so many years that I wanted to switch it up. And I love Gain. We used to use Gain all the time. But I thought, let's give the ATB brand a try. I just want to see how good it cleans. And it wasn't, it was a lot cheaper than Tide. Let's just be honest. Not by a lot, but a little. So I'm just going to give it a shot. I still have probably half a big bottle, but I don't like to be without. So I make sure that I keep something on hand. So if I was going to switch laundry detergent, I needed to switch fabric softener because I wanted to keep the same scent. Yes, I'm picky that way. Three gallons of water, um, a 20 pack of Coke. I've not bought the kids any soda in a while and I decided to get them some. Two things of hot dog buns, some frozen french fries, some frozen tater tots, three cans, small cans of biscuits, um, that is for the chicken and dumplings. I use my mother-in-law's recipe. So that is what my husband likes. I needed some more quart bags, some more eggs. We're going through eggs like crazy. Some celery, some green onions. The green onions is also for tonight. Um, brown sugar, some corn tortillas, also for tonight. I bet you can't guess what we're having. Hot dog buns, um, some lima beans. I've not made butter beans in a long time, and it's time for some butter beans. Some spaghetti. I needed some more saltines because if we're having chili, sometimes we like it with saltines and cheese. Sometimes I like it with Fritos for Frito pie. Two cans of cream of mushroom soup. Two cans of cream of chicken soup. The customary crystal light in the lemonade. Two packs of chili seasoning. This is my favorite. I really like the hot, but they didn't have it, so this will do. An obscene amount of canned uh, chili beans. I knew that I got three. I don't know why I have five, but whatever. I'll hold them on hand. 
they actually, these chili beans really go good on nachos. So I'm kind of glad I have two extra cans because uh, that may be that Saturday that's empty. We may make um, build your own nachos because yum. Two cans of spinach, uh, four cans of diced tomatoes and green chilies, some sloppy joe sauce, some black pepper, and that is it, my friends. That's it. So I'm going to go put this away and I need to get into that crock pot so I can finish cooking supper. There's a step I need to do. Actually, there's two steps I need to do. And so I need to read over that recipe real quick and get this stuff put away and make sure dinner is done on time. So thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for watching. Now you know what we're eating this week and some of the recipes you may see in a vlog or two. Uh, with the husband being furloughed and home, I don't know how much I will vlog. Um, we'll have to see. Um, we'll just all be surprised together. How about that? <laughs> so I'm going to get cracking and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Hey, make sure you come back tomorrow because um, you're going to want to see this recipe. I promise. Mm -hmm.